hello everyone welcome back to my channel please if you're new welcome my name is martha aka Gis, aka mama biggie and guys i am the one and only original mrs mayaki if it is your very first time please hit the red subscribe button and please pause go down and like the video at the end of the video please if you have anything at all anything to say any contributions please leave it down in the comment section and as well I don't know if you're in the UAE already and you're watching this video please tell me where you think is the best place to live as a job seeker because that is what we are going to be sharing today we'll be sharing to my opinion the best place I think it's suitable for a job seeker to live in the UAE when visiting UAE for the very first time but first thing first it's business time let's go do business oh yes lovely people it's business time again no you can visit our page on facebook it's our official business page and patronize your girl please do your girl a favor follow our page and like our photos and videos we upload on facebook that's the best you can do for your girl so i encourage everyone to visit our page make me your business blog and again your girl comes with the boat cruise are you visiting dubai for the first time are you in dubai already and you want to cruise around you want to see the lovely water view of dubai make Mata your boat cruise blog hit me up for a discount hit me up for a discount still here then you are a lover of Martha you are a lover of Mama Bike you are a lover of the one and only original Mrs. Maeke and you're interested in what I'm about to say okay guys in the UAE okay particularly Dubai we know there are so many streets we have streets for the rich we have streets for the poor actually nobody is actually is poor in life it all depends on your mindset if you have the mindset of a rich man then you are a rich man and we all are rich because we are still alive to me i think a poor man is a dead man because when you're dead even your money or at the point of dying that dying state even your money cannot save you so the only poor man i know on earth is a dead man so guys let's go to places i think it is best for guys to my opinion there are six areas in dubai where a job seeker should live when visiting uae for the very first time the very first place i have in mind is Dera. of course we all know Dera. For those who are just hearing it for the very first time there is a place called Dera, and it is option number one number two option bojuman yeah jo bojuman is very good number three mankul number four satwa number five ariga and number five basha those are the six key areas i think a job seeker should be living when visiting UAE for the very first time I have my reasons I don't know in the comment section if you think there is another area where you live or you've lived then tell us in the comment section and give us your reasons because I have five reasons why I think these areas are the best first reason is these areas, living in these areas, you can live on a budget. When it comes to accommodation, you can find shared rooms and it will cost you about 1200 to 1500 Yes. And if you want to live in a bed space, when I talk about shared room, I mean it's going to be a partition. That's what we call partition. But if you want to live in a bed space, it could cost you 600, 700 to 800 AED. That's affordable. Yeah. But for someone 
who wants to live in a full room it will cost you about 2700 dirhams to 3000 dirhams so it all depends on you that's reason number one now reason number two is if you're living in these areas i have listed access to the metro is five to ten minutes trust me guys for those who, when I say metro, some people may not understand, especially some of my viewers who are in Africa. Metro is the train. Now, in Dubai, the common man, if you, let me not just say the common man, I can say everybody. It's either you choose to use the train, which is going to take time, or you use the taxi. Taxis will be faster but more expensive using the public transport the train it will be a little bit slow but less expensive it's affordable so it all depends on the matter uh, the urgency if where you're going to it's really urgent you need to get there sharp 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 okay you go by taxi but if you're using the train, you use your train. And when using the train, it's either you use the train, you get to maybe a particular area and you use the bus that will actually take you into the streets. The trains don't really take you to your doorsteps, but the, uh, the bus will lead you to your bus, uh, to your doorstep. And it is the same fare. It's not like what you're paying for the train will be different from what you're paying when using the bus. No, it is the same. The train and the bus, they work together. So, reason number two is accessibility. These areas are accessible. Now, reason number three, why I think these areas are the best for a job seeker. Guys, food. Hmm? This thing we put in, in our mouth that goes to the stomach is less expensive in this area. It's affordable. Food will cost you about 8 to 10 dirhams. And that is something we should consider when living in a particular area. If you want to go to a place, you should consider, can I cook for myself if I'm late, if I'm in a hurry and I need to take dinner? Dinner can cost you about 8 to 10 dirham. And in France, say far, based on the exchange rate now, 10 dirham should be about 1,900 francs safer. So you see, in Cameroon level, say it's expensive, but Dubai level, it's okay, it's affordable. So food in this area is less expensive. So that's another reason. You should, that's reason number three why you should consider living in these areas I have listed. Now, let's go to reason number four. Now, reason number four is medical services, banks, shops, supermarket, and bus stops are usually very close in these areas. You'll find all these things, and these are the things we need every day day to day in our lives we use some of these things so if you're sick you easily rush to the hospital you want to use the bank it is not that far like what else do you want hmm? like what else do you really want in this life i'm expecting you guys in the comment section if you have anything else tell me now reason number five the last but not the least is Reason number five is, these areas I have listed, they are usually lively. The people you find around this area are usually happy. The evenings are always colorful. You meet people just strolling. Some of them are exercising. Some of them are even eating in the parks, the roadside. You just, like, you, you feel at home. Yes. You really feel at home in these areas. The people are usually smiling. For no reason, you'll find them being happy. So what do you think, guys? Who is ready to come to Dubai? Dubai is a place 
to enjoy, to live, to be happy. So who is joining us in Dubai? And who has something else to say? Please, I want to hear in the comment sections. Tell me, where do you live if you are in Dubai? Or if you're planning to come to Dubai, which of these places will you choose? And if you're still in Africa, Asia, Europe, America, you're planning to come to Dubai. By the time you get here, please tell me if this information was useful. Tell me if it was helpful. When you finally get a place to stay, tell me come back to this video and tell me where you live and please indicate there tell me if this video was what made you choose where you stay right now i love you all so much see you guys when next i upload another video bye bye